Hey, good morning. Welcome back to Arkansas Fishing Videos. This is Alan. I wanted to jump on this morning um, before it gets to be 500 degrees here in Arkansas and do a quick video. Um, we're almost 100% complete on our boat project. I've got to uh, put some screws in the hatches and tighten those down and then, then we'll be, we'll be uh, completely finished with it. Uh, I did last week uh, going through kind of a final inspection. <clears throat> took the wheels and bearing buddies, bearing buddies off to check the bearings on the trailer and found out that they needed to be replaced. And so I'm gonna show you what we did for that. Um, I don't have a press and so it can be kind of a uh, hard or kind of a struggle to, to replace the races and bearings inside these hubs. And so what I decided to do this time was, and they were in pretty bad shape, was just go and uh, pick up new four lug uh, complete bearing assembly sets it comes with everything uh, new lug nuts new caps which I'll show you that we didn't I didn't use the caps that came in this I put a new set of what they call bearing buddies that have a grease fitting on them but I'll show you that in just a second in the install um, but the lug nuts everything comes in here a new carter key uh, or, or uh, a pin to hold the castle nut on uh, but I'll uh, and I'll put a link below in the description of where I, I, I purchased these so We're starting out all brand new hub assemblies on both sides of the trailer and then uh, the next time We need new bearings. I'll uh, I'll just replace just pack those and replace those uh, Then so I'm gonna pause the video now and I will show you uh, the old assembly and then uh, putting the new uh, bearing or hub assembly and bearings on Okay, so here's what we're starting with. This is my old hub and bearings and um, When I took the bearing buddy off it had a little bit of water in it So I'll get the castle nut off and we'll get it cleaned up and then I'll show you how easy it is to add Put the new hub with bearing assembly on there All right, I've got our spindle cleaned up I'm gonna try to hold this camera as steady as possible. I'm hand holding here, but got all the got the old assembly off, got all as much of the grease and stuff as I could off of the spindle. So we're ready to put the new assembly on there. And this is the assembly, like I said. Uh, it's a CE Smith four lug kit. It comes with everything you need. Um, everything except for a castle nut, and I'll show you that. Uh, in just a second so let me uh, let me spin the case around here and get it open and so there's our new assembly and then inside this package right here is your uh, new lug nuts uh, a new uh, pin for the that goes through the the uh, castle nut to hold the hold the nut on so the hub doesn't slide off and then the the uh, hub, hub assembly that already has uh, new races new bearings and it's already greased so let me I'm gonna pause the camera and um, I'll get this out of the package and then um, I'll show you how it goes on there okay so here's our new assembly like I said you can see the grease here it's already pre-greased I'm just gonna take it out of the package here and you can see the grease the front bearing on there I'm just gonna slide it up on there you have a little bit of grease in the bearing may try to slide out on you a little bit there we go and then I just take pack this grease back in there around there there's your can now this comes with a cap uh, just a little metal cap that goes over it. But what I use, and most I think everybody does, is these bear, they're called bearing but this is, they call these bearing protectors or bearing buddies. It has a grease fitting on the end, so it, it uh, once you get it on there, you put your grease gun on there and fill it up, and then cap it off, and that uh, helps keep it greased. So uh, I'll get the uh, castle nut on there. This is what the nut looks like. Uh, you want to be sure and save this because like I said the the uh, new bearings the assembly That's the only thing that does not come in this package is that uh, is this castle nut. I'm not sure why um, It may be because of the spindle sizes. I'm not really sure. But anyway, I just cleaned this I just cleaned mine up really well 
and then I'll pack this grease back in there, put the nut back on, and then put the pan in to hold it in, and then um, put the uh, bearing buddy on there and grease it, and we're ready to go. And there's our finished product with the uh, new wheel and tire on there, bearing buddy, and the cap for the bearing buddy. So there you go. That's uh, we've got brand new hubs, hub assemblies on both sides, brand new bearing buddies uh, to keep them keep the uh, bearings greased now, and uh, that's going to be the uh, complete completion of the project. Like I said, I've just got I bought some screws and I need to uh, secure the hatches down to the decking and then we're we're 100% complete and I will shoot um, probably gonna shoot some video maybe try to do it as, as soon as I finish this is uh, shoot the final video and kind of a, a final walkthrough and a before and after of the boat project so uh, that'll do it for this video uh, if you want to see the final uh, boat video uh, click the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell and I will put links above to the start to the project uh, or the start of the project so you can kind of see where we came from and uh, you know everything we did the electronics building the decks all everything if you have any questions you can drop them in the comments below and I'll be happy to tell you uh, any any question you have about the boat the project where we got anything just drop it in the comments below and i will uh, i'll respond to them as quickly as possible all right thanks we'll see you guys next time